Welcome to Appetite for the Outdoors with Carolina Cooker. I'm Chef Chad McIntyre. Today we got a very special dish. We're actually going to cook tundra swan. So what we're going to do is we're going to first win it and take our celery seed and we're going to do a little light toast on this guy to kind of bring out some of the flavors and the oils actually in the celery seed itself. Next we're going to go ahead and put in our thyme, kind of do the same. Then we're going to go ahead and put in about a cup of vegetable oil. So the oil is heating up right now. We're going to go ahead and add in the last of our ingredients into this for the marinade, which is some fresh minced garlic and some red chili flakes. The last one you got is some apple cider vinegar. Just want to make sure it doesn't boil up too much on you. And we're going to let this come to a simmer right here. This is going to be our marinade that we're actually going to kind of brush the swan breast down with whenever we do the cooking. Now before we start it, we're going to add salt and pepper to the breast, season it up a lot, and get both sides. We're going to sear it off on a nice high heat and then we're gonna finish it off in our oven for about 10 minutes or so. Like I said, the temperature when you want to get to these is about medium, rare, medium. Treat them just like duck breast. We gave this guy about eight minutes in the oven and we're gonna baste it one more time and then we're gonna actually let it rest. Perfect. Nice medallions. So a beautiful dish, very simple, very straightforward and true to the nature of the animal. We're lucky enough here in North Carolina to be able to harvest these animals. It's always nice to be able to take the game in the field, but it's always even better when you can incorporate it in the meal in the house.